This blue gemstone is one of the most rare gemstones in the world. It's called Danitoite. You can find it in California, but when you first find it in the wild, it looks like this. So today we're going to refine that purple gemstone out of this host rock, and I'll show you how we do it. Pretty cool. These are some of the most rare gemstones in the world. They're called Benito White. And you can actually mine them yourself at the Benito White Mining Company in Coalinga, California. I think right now they charge about $100, and for that you can dig all day and keep what you find. Which is really cool. It's like a once in a lifetime opportunity. You cannot find these rocks anywhere else in the world. But when you first get them, they look like this. And I'm going to zoom in so you can really see. You see that small little speck of blue crystal? That is the gemstone that we're going to try to get out. They're in this white naturalite host rock. You can see it a lot in all these other rocks as well. There's many ways to get that bonito white out of that host rock. You can drill it, you can dremel it, you could chisel it down. However, it's going to be very difficult because that bonito white is not very hard. We're going to use a much softer approach. We're going to put it in acid. So let's see what it looks like when we melt it away with acid. We're going to use muriatic acid. This is very cheap acid. You can buy this for 10 bucks at the hardware store. Here's what it looks like after one hour. Immediately it starts reacting. Here's what it looks like after two hours. It's melting away all that naturalite, all that calcite based mineral. And let's check out what it looks like after 24 hours. So it's been soaking overnight for 24 hours and you can just see those blue gemstones underneath just starting to peek out. However, it's not quite at the quality that we want it at. We really want to get all that white natural light off so we can really see the shape and, and form and color of those blue crystals. So I'm going to scrub some of this excess acid off and you're going to see, I'm going to put it into the acid for another, another 24 hours. We're going to put it in for a total of 48 hours, two days overnight, and that, that natural light, that white rock, is just going to melt away. We're going to be able to just scratch it off with our bare hands. It's going to be really cool to watch, so let's fill that up. We're going to let it sit overnight. We're going to rinse it off, really wash it thoroughly. You don't want any of that stuff on your hands. And after 48 hours, check that out. Look, you can just brush off that natural light. It just dissolves. And after you just crush it, the gemstone comes out perfectly. That's a really high-grade Benito White crystal right there. And you can see this one right here, peeking out of that host rock. Um, some of this natural light was really thick. We gotta let it dissolve. This one, oh, this is great. You can see it's just sky blue. And it's just peeking right out. Perfect either for display purposes or if you want to take the fully formed crystals and put them into jewelry. Benito White is a really amazing gemstone for any collector to have in their collection. It's super rare. It's also pretty valuable. And if you ever get your hands on some Benito White, maybe this video will help you too. Refining Benito White. Pretty cool.